most jobs can be taught with on-the-job training and shouldn't require a college degree. With a few exemptions i.e. doctors, and some STEM careers I think that most jobs could be taught with on-the-job training, and don't need a college degree. Coming from someone who went to college, I feel like it was a complete waste of time and money. Once you get into the job, you still either need a trainer mentor internship and that's where you actually learn how to do your daily tasks. As a graphic designer, I agree. I learned the most about the field by working in the field. But, college really helped prepare me for the theory and the how to be a good designer. Though it was terrible for learning how to put those skills into a workplace and produce work. So maybe a bit of both? It's probably more about filtering people out. If someone has relevant experience but no degree they usually win out over someone inexperienced with a degree. However, it's too risky for a company to hire someone with no experience and no degree. Plus you'd just be flooded with more people applying who are clearly not well suited for the job. My whole career, basically, has been OJT. The problem is, out of the pool of candidates, how do you pick the one who will actually learn all that there is to teach? That is super tricky. Things like logic tests and puzzles sort of help but those weed out a lot of people that would be capable but get nervous in interviews, and then panic because test. So I don't know, college is a standard, a flawed one, but one nonetheless. Every job can be taught on the job. But it takes more time up for the company. Jobs don't need it, professions do. I'd say one thing I noticed is people who went to university have a better framework for self-learning and critical thinking. And that is a big university benefit without pointing directly at employment. Sure, but I guess that would come with a fair share of expensive mistakes and a lot of time before beginners become truly useful depending on the job. Anyway, I feel like one of the biggest things that come with university are the social aspects, what you learn in such an environment and the connections you make along the way. College is about exposure not mastery. I'm always a little amazed when I work with someone without a degree in a business to find the really weird holes in their knowledge. I am always so sad to come across a person who went to university and managed to come out the other side thinking the only point of their degree was to prepare them for a specific job. University teaches you critical thinking skills the ability to evaluate information and use it for effective decision making at a high level, among other soft and hard skills. Or it should. I'm sorry you paid so much money to miss out on so much. Employers know this too, but a college degree lets them know that you're able to absorb and learn complicated topics without complete hand-holding. Man, as someone who's hired at multiple levels from entry level to senior manager. Nah, I'm good. I prefer to hire people who at least have demonstrable commitment to finishing a degree. It helps that most people with a degree usually can construct a sentence and write a decent email. I'm sorry that you didn't like college, but go hire non-grads even for entry-level work and you'll quickly see why so many people go back to hiring college grads. Wow let's be as vague as possible without real examples. Hard disagree. I'm in business and have a master's degree. I couldn't do my job without a high-level understanding of business concepts like finance, sales, marketing, logistics, etc., and how they all work together. No one has the time to train someone on all these things. It's a puzzle that you have to understand or you will not be successful. Higher education, generally, needs to be disentangled from employment. It should be about learning cool stuff and growing as a person, not about developing specific skills valuable to an employer. It should be treated as good in itself, as an ends and not a means, first and foremost. Sure, there's lots of instrumental benefits from higher education, not just for the individual but for society generally including employers, but the focus should really be to treat it as a good thing simply in itself. Getting a degree proves you have a mind that is capable of learning new things. It shows you know how to make a commitment. It also gives you the basics, so companies don't have to waste their time teaching that stuff. The problem is college is too damn expensive. It has no reason to be so, it's gotten so outrageous it borders on fraud. There are other ways of showing you can hold commitments, like military service or completing apprenticeship programs for trades. 
I think a combination of on-the-job training and a college degree is ideal. College gives you the theoretical knowledge of how to do something, while on-the-job training gives you the practical experience needed to succeed in the job. Both are important and should be valued by potential employers. Yeah it sucks, other than profession, any job can be taught or self-taught. Sadly in my country they always prioritize someone with a degree first rather than experiences and skill. My favorite is now hiring for exposition but requires four years of exposition experience. Very dependent on the industry, but STEM in general should require degrees. So instead of you wasting time and money, you want a company to waste their time and money on you? I would just exploit this and get paid to be a student in all different fields for the rest of my life. Not every job is productivity based. A lot of careers are focused more on problem solving. Unfortunately, the world we live in defines you by the piece of paper you have from a university. Undergrad is about teaching you how to learn. People with degrees are much easier to bring up to speed. Back in the day, the burden of training employees used to be on the employer. With the push of increased college attendance, employers were able to push the irresponsibility and cost of training from themselves to the employee. We now have a societal expectation that it is your responsibility to be ready for the job instead of the company's responsibility to train you for the position. What's this on the job training thing? Company I work for shows you how to use the most basic machine in the factory and that's it. There's machinery there that management wouldn't know how to use on their best day and we just get to figure it out on our own. Then they bitch if anything goes wrong. Given that the staff turnover is astoundingly high, they must save a fortune in training costs. Work in manufacturing. I've trained people who never used a tool in their life. They did fine. Other people who claim to have experience don't listen, think they know better can't remember a thing. I think it's better to go in fresh so you can be mold. I'm welding for an aerospace company. I could teach any idiot with steady hands how to do my job within a few months. Job required seven goddamn years experience to qualify. And yet all employers care about is the fact you have a stupid fucking $50,000 piece of paper. You could have barely graduated, worked in a different field for 20 years, and returned to the industry you studied for after the fact and that overpriced piece of paper is still going to get you a job. I agree with this. But that's not really why people should go to college. You go to college to learn how to think. If you want to learn a job go to technical school. You should have to go to college to be considered an educated person. People misunderstand the point of college education, it isn't just you should know this to get a job. Definitely true to the point where it is ridiculous. Here in Germany it has become apparent, however, that companies who do need a bit more brain have lots of applicants with straight as but they are too stupid for the job. Our education system creates idiots. In the UK we now have degree apprenticeships which are working as a great alternative from what I've seen. For example in my country, there are apprenticeships which last around 2-4 years depending on the profession and which school degree you have for many professions where you work and go to school so that you get a, a practical foundation while learning more theoretical stuff. So I wouldn't call it an unpopular opinion as at least three whole countries agree with you. Whatever. This is not an unpopular opinion. Just an uninformed one. No. Every job comes with on-the-job training. That doesn't mean you don't need to know some shit before you show up. If a job requires a college degree, it's likely there's a lot of background knowledge, field-specific knowledge, or general workload aptitude that they want to make sure you have, before you show up and are in over your head. I understand law degrees can be pretty handy. Is OP another teenager trying to get out graduating high school? Smiling face with open mouth and tightly closed eyes. College and higher education isn't just about job prep.